Define Doc captures the metadata that you've selected from your input data sets and generates the Define XML. All you have to do is type in the file. It could be named anything, but the extension is what's important. In this case, if I were to type in Define XML and click on the Generate button, it will get the latest metadata here and generate this for me. So in this case, not only does it generate the XML file, it also generates an accompanying um, style sheet. This style sheet allows you to have this navigational bookmark similar to a PDF file that you can navigate to a specific metadata attribute of all the variables. So in this particular example, the metadata is captured and the Excel the XML files generated along with the style sheet. Now by simply changing the file extension to PDF, in this case I'm going to get the same metadata and generate the PDF version of this document. By clicking on generate, it will capture all the same information and then generate the PDF file. In this case it's the same except uh, in PDF format with the navigational link to bookmark to the metadata of the PDF um, file itself. So the same information is generated in different formats. In fact, you can generate an Excel file or a Word document for internal review um, that might be useful as well. For example, let's say if I were to do an RTF for a Word file, this might be a useful format for internal team members to view that same information in a Word document with all the same hyperlinking as well. So this is an alternative as to how you can generate this information. So all the metadata is the same and the only effort that's required is to change the file extension of the output file and then clicking on the generate button will generate your output um, define XML in the various formats. In fact, the XML version, if you were to regenerate that file, it if you have created your PDF file, it would automatically create a link to that PDF file. So as you can see here, this is the uh, XML file with the company style sheet and when I click on this, it then opens up the PDF file um, if you have it generated. So they're all can be interconnected and this tool has the flexibility of generating it in the different formats depending on if you're sending it to a collaborator or the FDA or if you're doing it, an internal review which might be useful for Word and Excel.